Hello and welcome to the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Rodri plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the park. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. And now they get the ball rolling. De Bruyne. Not a pity that. It looked promising, but that's going to be claimed by the keeper. Sterling. Chelsea unable to hold on to the ball. De Bruyne. Manuel Ak Kanji. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Holland. Well read to put an end to that attack. Jackson. Fernandez. De Bruyne now. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Out of play, City throw. Bernardo Silva. And with that, the attack fizzles out. This attack looks highly promising. Oh, he's through here. In it goes. That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So underway again here, 1-0 the score. Room to roam for City on the wing. Must be! Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. Fernandez. On to James. Enzo Fernandez. Sterling. Thiago Silva. Looking away patiently, looking for an opening. And the flag.
Does go up, must have been close. Rodri. Crucial interception amid impending danger. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. And he whips it in. This might be ideal for the counter. And showing fine vision. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Offside. Well, he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there. Just let the ball be played into the space. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. Mikhailo Mudrik. Mudrik. Well, possession seeded. A City free kick forthcoming. De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. And will it be the leveller? That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Akanji. Top class defending. Sterling. Holland. And Chelsea come away with it. He's in with a chance. Can they cover up? And I think the threat has been averted. Well, you do sense that City will get this equaliser at some point. But at the moment, they're still trailing. And that's mainly due to a brilliant stop by the goalkeeper. Yes, they just have to make sure they stay defensively compact here. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And support available. Straight offside, but only just. Not a great pass. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Holland. Doku. Walker now. De Bruyne. Oh, big chance. And tremendous goalkeeping. Well, he just made it so difficult for the striker. His presence alone just caused him a problem. In the short corner, let's see. Now veering in field. That is a really disappointing effort, goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Palmer with it. Mudrik. Sterling. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And that's an important intervention. And there we have it. That brings to an end the first half here at the Etihad. Well, Kevin De Bruyne is a wonderful player, one of the best in the world, Stuart, but even the best have their off days. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this. And so the battle commences.
Well, they get the ball rolling once more. Chelsea in front, but there might still be a few twists and turns before this is over. And space for them here on the flank. It's Sterling cutting in. And the keeper diving to thwart him. So making the substitution now. Let's see about the delivery. And the danger still on. Silva. Now the shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Rodri. Foden. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. And a chance to level it. And that's what they needed. Manchester City. A goal to level matters here. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So back underway following the equaliser. James. He might be able to profit from the wide position. And showing fine vision. Not going to get away with that because it's offside here and he shouldn't be offside there he's gone too early and that's a waste of a great opportunity Rodri now who can he play it to Foden timely intervention Jackson Sterling has it wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up and they're making a change so a half an hour remaining Connor Gallagher good visualization and execution well, the flag was up in good time, bringing that move to an end. Well, he's just got to be more patient there. He's gone too early. Nicely cut out. Out of play for what will be a Chelsea throw. James. Sterling has it. comes to absolutely nothing Fernandez he's lost it Ronaldo Silva can they create something from here De Bruyne, can they take the lead? And he didn't hesitate, good thing too. Well, he's so quick off his line, that's great goalkeeping, you have to say. Into the final 20 minutes. And very deftly cut out. And a Chelsea throw in coming up here. He's given us away. A 
the pass could do damage. He must finish. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. Well, here it is again. The through ball is wonderfully executed, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Walker. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Grealish. And on to Kovacic. Superb block. De Bruyne. Well, they've given him too much space. De Bruyne. On to Silva. No nonsense clearance. Rather than a free kick, the tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. And Sterling has it. Now couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. And time for the change now. Thiago Silva five minutes remaining and one thing is certain no one is leaving because it's still close Ruben Dias De Bruyne now well these City fans still believe they can get back into this but they're going to have to throw everything at it now time is running out on the ball in an attacking position but they've got to do something positive quickly and that wasn't a million miles away almost the equaliser well it's not a bad effort is it but they've got to find a way back into this one and a substitution in the offing Doesn't want to lose his cool here. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Gallagher and intercepts again. Kovacic. Well, the supporters think it's on. Timely intervention. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Time is against Manchester, and that is full-time. Chelsea have prevailed. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes, and they fully deserved their victory today. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer. And Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.